Hey, guys. Oh, why the long face? Feeling gloomy? One, his face is long because he tried to stretch his skin to make it look like he's too old to go to school. Two, no, Mom didn't buy it. And three, yes, I'm feeling gloomy. Oh, man, I don't know how you guys do it. It's not that difficult to stretch your face. There's an online tutorial for everything nowadays. So, did you finish it? No, this? I mean, I don't know how you go to school every day. Rocky, you drive us there. Well, I don't have to. Really? Yeah, we're on a bus. We could go anywhere. Like under the sea, or outer space, or up a rainbow? Well, anywhere with a road. But not up steep hills. Or under low bridges. Let's do it! After all, we've got the rest of our lives to go to school. Well, I think we should go to school, so we can work hard and get the best possible start in life. Anyone else want to go to school? No. <laughs> okay, no school it is! So, where should we go instead? The beach. The school bus. We're already on the school bus. <laughs> what about the water park? <laughs> All righty, we just gotta make one more stop. Is that all of you, Mr. Pink? Almost. Looks like Mr. Yellow didn't make it. <laughs> Why catch the bus when the bus can catch you? <laughs> The binoculars made it look closer than it was. So I guess it's still quite fun. Uh, all right, we'll go to the water park, then the beach. <clears throat> Good afternoon, children. My name is Mr. Brown, this is Mr. Pink, Mr. Rainbow, and Mr. White. And we'll be your captors for the day. The exits are irrelevant, because you're going nowhere. Nobody move, or I'll be forced to use this. <gasps> it's a briefcase! No, more than that. <gasps> It's a ticking briefcase! No, more than that! <gasps> it's a no, 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 less than that! Ah, uh, yes, we are legally obliged to say it's not one of those. Oh my gosh, it's not a bus! Oh, come on, guys. It's obviously not a bus. It's ticking! And masked strangers have taken over the bus! But they're clearly our parents trying to teach us some sort of lesson. Principal Brown hasn't even changed his name. Yes, I have. Uh, I mean, he has. I, I mean, he hasn't. I, I mean, who is this Principal Brown? You are. Oh, uh, yes. We're going to call the cops and tell them we won't release you until our demands are met. Make the call, Mr. Rainbow. I thought we were going to disguise my voice. Um. <sighs> All right. Hello, police. We have taken control of the school bus, and you better do what we say, or there'll be consequences. Oh, sorry. Or there'll be consequences. Oh, come on, Alan. You're telling me you don't even recognize the balloon? Wait. I do recognize him. Yeah? I saw him in our house last night. Yeah? On TV. Elmore's Most Wanted. <sighs> it's just our parents trying to teach us a lesson. Like when my dad tried to teach us the dangers of texting while walking. Help me! I put it down this manhole because I was texting while walking. Darwin, you can't seriously be scared of these guys. Of course I am. They're criminal masterminds. I just think it would be fun. I've never been in a hovercraft. No, we should ask for a private jet. They always ask for a private jet. Could it be a private hovercraft? We need to ask for money. How much? It doesn't matter. The police know this is all fake. See? They're not scary. You're right. We just need a leader to reason with. Someone brave. <clears throat> Someone who's not afraid to look the enemy in the eye. <clears throat> Someone who laughs in the face of danger. <laughs> <laughs> I would say you, Gumball, but you're obviously sick. Maybe less. No, me! I'll do it! Oh, but hovercrafts are... Hmm? Uh, Dad? It's Mr. Pink. Fine, Mr. Pink. I know it's you, Dad. Uh... I've never heard of this dad of whom you speak. I'm just a criminal. How did I become a criminal, you ask? I didn't ask. I suppose it all started when I was 11 years old and skipped a math class. Uh -huh. And for this crime, the punishment was harsh and swift. I spent 12 years in juvie, then five years inside, then 24 years on the run, then 30 years back in the big house, then a further seven in solitary. That makes you 89, it doesn't add up. Well, I wouldn't know, because I skipped that math class. Sure. So, I assume you all ended up in a life of crime through skipping school? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, my tragic story starts on the right side of the tracks, but boy, it sure doesn't stay there. Yeah, yeah, we get it. But I learned the whole thing. Don't I get to... Oh. See, I told you, it's a load of hooey. 